Literally everyone here is vlogging. They're just like, oh, we're at the White House. I'm sleeping in it, bro. I'm sleeping in it. Huh? <laughs> Today is the day. It's actually a huge day and I have to get ready. Woo! Shower, dress, almost ready for today. Now, Jake, what is it that you are doing? Why is it such a big day? Well, let me tell you. So, a couple weeks ago, the White House emailed me and they said, Yo, Jake, we're having this event with a bunch of influencers. Do you want to come and attend? They said, Obama's going to be there, Michelle Obama, Joe Biden, and you'll get to meet them, videotape with them, all of this stuff. So I was like, duh. But then I was like, what do I want to do before I die? And one of those things, is have a sleepover at the White House. So I thought, why not vlog myself doing an overnight challenge at the White House? This is probably my once in a lifetime opportunity where I will actually be inside of the White House where I could go like into a bathroom and try and sleep overnight there and then leave in the morning. Oh! Bro, what if I actually do this? Sorry, Ter. I'm so sorry. Sorry about that. Jake Paulers, I am going to try my 100% hardest to do this today. I have to be there in two hours. In the meantime, they told me to dress business attire, and me being the idiot that I am, I brought jeans and like this shirt. So I have to go and, and Yeezys as my dress shoes. So I have to go to the store right now and get some business attire clothes. Jesus, Jake, what were you thinking? You're going to the White House and he brought Yeezys? God! All right, Jake Paulers. Let's see if we can pull this off today. If I don't make it out of there, you won't ever know because they'll probably delete this footage. <laughs> Let's go get some clothes for the White House. All right, here at the store. Let's see what they got for this White House attire. I'm so bad at like dressing nice. Yo, my man, I need your help. I'm going to the White House and I need to look fly. What do you got for me? You got some fire? I feel like I need like a suit jacket, right? I think like black. I was gonna wear this. Is that dumb? <laughs> you cannot wear this. <laughs> Yo. All right, you guys got me? Yeah. My boy. My boy's got me. All right, so they got the hookups. Let me see what I can do. Ooh, your boy's kind of hot. Hey, I'm about to cop this. Go get some lunch. And then it's White House time. Yay! All dressed up. Got the fit on. We made it work. We pulled it together last second. How about that suit montage though? We are here at lunch. I'm here with my manager, Alex. What's up? And hey, he hey, knows. Subscribe. He knows. He knows. Do you know what I want to do today? No. Do you know what this whole video is about? I missed the last one. What is it about? I want to try and sleep overnight at the White House. <laughs> That's not even a thing. Do you think I could sleep overnight at the White House? No. <laughs> you don't think it's possible? No. I'm gonna attempt to do it. <laughs> I look like Draco Malfoy, but we are <laughs> walking over to the White House right now to this event. The reality of me actually about to like do this is starting to set in, <laughs> but I have like some time to kill. The it's event. not a thing. It's not a thing. I'm going to do this. No one can stop me except the Secret Service, <laughs> but besides them, it's fine. But it's like two o'clock now, so I have some time to kill. The event goes till like eight o'clock. So at some point during it, I have to like break away from the crowd and like find a place to stay. So until then, you're just gonna be like following the journey of kind of the event. And I think like some of my friends are gonna be there. I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to film, but let's do it. Okay, we're walking up to the White House. Just got to the event. We have to go through security over here. I don't think they're gonna let me film, but I'm gonna try and like leave the camera on. Let's do this. This is it, bro. That's the White House right there. We're gonna be all up inside of there. Uh, you look right near me, I think it was hard. There you go. Good idea. You guys are good. We're good? Cool. Made it through. I don't know how much of this I'm going to be able to record, but. I didn't know. It's just your idea. Oh, okay. Oh, good. Put all that stuff in. Please go on Thank you. I appreciate all you guys do, man. <laughs> you never, you didn't run in that. Made it through. Now we're going in. So we're inside. There's like <laughs> literally like cops and stuff everywhere. I'm just gonna blend in now and uh, talk to some of my peeps. Yo, look at how crazy this place is. I don't know like where I'm gonna be able to go. The East Wing, for an impromptu tour of a little bit of the East Wing and the gardens. So the post will just follow me. Yo, we're out here. You were in the thinning with my bro. Yeah. You guys kissed, right? We did. Is kiss. he a good kisser? <laughs> <laughs> hey! 
Logan. You know what I'm gonna try and do? I'm trying to like sleep overnight here. I'm doing an overnight challenge. Okay, yeah, like that. That's totally gonna work. I'm gonna do out this. They don't believe in me. So we're going over to a tour, apparently outside the White House. I don't know. So we walked outside, and they're like giving us a tour outside and all this stuff. Look at how ridiculous this is. Like I'm, I'm like legitimately at the White House right now, bro. This is the East Wing, and I think this is like where I'm gonna post up. Obama. We out here waiting for you. <laughs> Your boy and the Jake Paulus at the White House. Mama, we doing something right. We doing something right. They said they were just little videos, bro. I believe that. <laughs> Follow your dreams, kids. There's like a whole army of people here. I'm gonna like introduce you to all of them because they're all like really cool people, but this means it's just gonna be easier to like jump out of the group and like dip out. You know what I'm saying? I'm plotting, bro. I'm Jason Bourne, bro. I'm Liam Neeson, bro. I will find you and I will kill you. Uh, apparently that's where Obama sleeps. I don't know where we're going now. It's like a dream come true. Another bucket list thing checked off with the Jake Paul as you guys watching. Also, today's notification shout out goes to Rebecca Jones. Thank you, Rebecca, for having my notifications turned on. If you guys want shout outs in these vlogs, just turn on the notifications and comment when you're done. Because it's every day, bruh. Going back inside. This is lit. This is a different area of it. Look at that. <laughs> There they are. Thank you, hang tight. I'll see you guys all in a little bit. You're not gonna see me. I'm gonna run away and hide in the bathroom. All right, this is all the way outside in front. A man here. What you up, may recognize up. him, may not. Will you help me get my... Oh, 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 look at that. Hey, come here. Right down here. They're strict. They're very strict. They don't play games. This is absolutely ridiculous. We literally get to walk around like in the front lawn of the White House. They're giving us a full tour, full access, but as you can see, they're still like pretty strict about where we can go. They just yelled at my dude here. <laughs> Yo, what are you guys doing here? I didn't even see you. Boom. Boom. So this is the White House garden. Um, pretty weak, if you ask me. Pretty weak. The White House garden, I mean, what are those, bro? It's a really weak garden. It's pretty weak, right? This is not a bad garden, right? I'm not too impressed with Michelle's gardening skills. I mean, look at it. It's kind of whack. Yo, we're, we're trying to take a group picture and it's not working out. This is a squad right here. Tyler, Tyler, it's not working. There's literally so many people. You should be an airplane director. Someone give him some orange sticks. That was the biggest group photo ever inside the White House. It's practically vid on here. Every influencer's here. It's lit. Literally everyone here is vlogging, right? I'm just saying, bro. $400 this vlog gets more views than them because the Jake Paulers go harder than everyone else. They're just like, oh, we're at the White House. I'm sleeping in it, bro. I'm sleeping in it. Just kidding. They're all my friends. We're innovating this stuff right here, bro. Jake Paulers, join the family. Where you at? All right, so we're at the White House. I'm here with my boy, Lewis House. He's from Ohio. Knuckle touch. Hey. hey. Lewis is an entrepreneur, very successful guy. Lewis, can you drop some knowledge on these kids? Yeah, I'm going to share a very simple quote. All right. It's easy. I grew up in the bottom of my class. When I went to school in Ohio, I was always one of the dumbest kids in class, the lowest grades. And I heard a quote in high school. Someone told me, I don't remember who said it, but the quote is this. People don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. And when I heard that, I realized I could achieve anything I wanted. If I connected with people in an emotional, human level, yeah. actually look you in your eyes, yeah. as opposed to try to share all the things I know, but more share how much I care, then you can create anything you want. It might be a little uh, fluffy, yeah. but I'm telling you, it works. That works. It, it works. works. Hey, all right, kids, remember that, and you'll go far in life. He made it. He made it. Mommy's at the White House. Heading back inside now, and I'm just going to like try and plot and like find a place to chill at. But it's looking successful. Like, there's a lot of us so we'll see it's so cold outside la i'm coming back for you soon baby all right so we're back inside say what's up to jimmy anwar's here anwar made it out i can't believe they let me in the white house why do you say that apparently we're going to listen to people speak it seems like what we're in for today bro i'm so not hyped for that it's five hours of like Come listening on, to people speak this is like a auditorium thingy people are going to speak up there about important issues and causes i feel like it's school again but you know i'm gonna be attentive all right guys i'm gonna listen to some of these speeches and uh, continue to plot. I think these speeches are gonna go on for a while. If there's any dope information, I want you guys to like learn about it because in these vlogs, I want to inspire you guys and motivate you guys every single day. So if there's something good, I'm gonna reiterate the information to you. I think the Vice President Joe Biden is gonna speak too, so I might show you guys some of that. Other than that, once we leave here, that's gonna be about time for me to like find a place to stay. So be right back. It takes enormous courage to do that. Enormous courage. That's my boy Joe Biden. Shout out to my boy. Speech is over. I don't know what's next. I'm gonna go to the president's podium and uh, act like I'm giving a speech. Look at Mom, I made it. The microphone is on. The microphone is on. Yo, Jake Pollers, I'm out. I'm dipping. I'm dipping. <laughs>
That's like where Obama gives his speeches, bro. That's lit. All joking aside, guys, I know the vlogs are like super funny and stuff like that. But that whole speech was just about how girls uh, getting like sexually assaulted and how it's on guys to like fix the problem and stand up for these girls if we see it happening. So if you're a guy and you're out there and you see a girl getting abused, you need to stand up and do something about it. Say something, tell someone, make it known. Don't be embarrassed to make that change. I know I don't get serious a lot, but I think it's super important that everyone should take action in doing that. Back to the vlog. All right, I'm breaking away from the crowd right now. I'm going to walk up these stairs and um, try and like find a spot for later tonight. I don't know if we're allowed to be up here, but we're blending in like we got the pests and stuff too. I'm thinking that the best thing is going to be to find like a bathroom because there's no cameras and stuff. It's like empty. So many stairs. I'm just gonna have to find a bathroom. I'm gonna meet up with the group again. All right, back with the group. We're doing another speech. I don't know, like, I'm not professional. I don't like these, like, sort of speeches. Yeah, his pants ripped open. Like, we're not meant for this. <laughs> we're, like, in the middle of the White House and his pants are open. We weren't made for this, but I'm gonna push through it. I'm gonna sit here. I'm gonna get rid of my ADD and I'm gonna, I'm gonna focus. Secret, Secret Service is looking for you right now, by the way. No way. They said the guy with the hair. Yo. Is that a Super Bowl ring right there? It is. Oh my I god. Still. You don't know my man Steve here is a Super Bowl champion. You're gonna let me put this on right now. Yo, this is so heavy. How do I look? I mean, you have the ring on upside down, but I don't know, like 48,000 or 47,000. <laughs> We're looking for the guy with the hair. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm about to just win a Super Bowl myself. <laughs> Yo, is that Obama? <laughs> he killed it. No one's made that joke before, though. No one's made that joke. Only 10 times today. Oh, okay, okay. Go Go back to Mbari. You're not good at this. It's dead, bro. It's dead. Go with it. We just wrapped up this, like, final speech thing. It's like 8 o'clock right now, and everyone's gonna go to dinner upstairs. This is my like shot to break away from the group. I'm like starting to get like really nervous. I feel like I'm getting in a lot of trouble. All right, let's do this. All right, guys, stay tuned. You're going into this bathroom. Yo, this is so sketchy. It's like nine o'clock now. I feel like people are still gonna be like coming in in and out of here like. I'm gonna have to like act like I'm going to the bathroom for like a while. Everyone's leaving like right in like 15 minutes and then it's just gonna be me. This is where I'm staying. The reality of this is like starting to sink in. Or something, they don't think I'm trying to hide. I'm texting. 
okay, so I had to walk around like the whole front of the White House. You guys better subscribe for that effort, bro. I almost went to jail for you guys. Subscribe. Give this a thumbs up, bro. It's every day, bro. Vlogs every day like this, bro. Don't miss it. Oh my god. Oh, there's one more cop. There's one more cop. <laughs> okay. I'm going to my hotel. My camera died mid-sentence. This is the best thing that's ever happened. I'm gonna call an Uber, bro. I'm going to sleep, getting on my flight in the morning, editing this and posting it. Tomorrow I'm going to Vegas. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> it's every day, bro. Peace.